taking continuous industrial action for more than four weeks. Despite every effort made by our negotiators, it is clear now that the government is directly interfering in our attempts to reach a settlement. The union suspended previous strike action in good faith to allow for intensive negotiations to resolve the dispute. Yet Network Rail has failed to make an improved offer on jobs, pay and conditions for our members during the last two weeks of talks. At the same time, the rail delivery group, representing the train operating companies, has also broken a promise to make a meaningful offer on pay and conditions, and even cancelled negotiations that were due to take place yesterday with one hour's notice. The authority now sits, di sits directly with the Secretary of State, Mark Harper, and he seems intent on blocking any deal being developed between the parties. I will be taking this up with him at a meeting that he, arranged, he has arranged with me for this Thursday morning. In the meantime, our message to the public is we are sorry to inconvenience you, but we urge you to direct your anger and frustration at the government and the railway employers during this latest phase of action.